if you are looking to make some additional income every single month, starting a passive income side hustle might be just the way to do that. In today's video, I'm going to share with you what I think are the five best side businesses that don't take a lot of time, don't take an upfront start cost, and can generate you money within the first month. All of these ideas are things that I have personally done or still do to generate thousands of dollars every single month. So they are all proven and tested. Now, each of these passive income businesses vary a little bit. So you can look at the full list and figure out what is going to fit you and your lifestyle perfectly. There are so many good ones in here. So make sure you stick around for the full list. Now let's jump right into it. Now, this first idea is probably one of my most favorite because it literally has a zero dollar starting cost. You could start this today and already be making a lot of profit and sales by the end of the week. And that is starting a print on demand t-shirt business. Now, if you're familiar at all with my channel, you know that this is one of the main things I talk about because it's enabled me to create a full time business through selling print on demand. Now, if you aren't familiar with print on demand, Basically, you are selling products like t-shirts, sweatshirts, tumblers, anything that you would have a printed element on. However, instead of having all the tools to print things at your house, having to keep inventory, having to ship items yourself, you are simply creating an account or a profile on several different print on demand sites, creating designs, uploading them. And then once you do that, the company takes care of everything for you. In starting a print on demand business, you would be responsible for researching what is selling well. You would create the designs and upload the products with all of the descriptions and keywords in there. But once you upload it, if that item sells, you don't do anything, meaning it is super, super passive. Now there there are several different sites to do this on, but there are definitely some that I prefer over others. Now, the number one site to sell completely passively is going to be Amazon Merch On Demand. Now, unlike a lot of these sites, Amazon Merch On Demand does have an application process, so it can be a little tricky to get into the program, but if you do get your application accepted and you can be a seller on Amazon Merch. There are built in so many shoppers that are going to Amazon every single day looking to buy t-shirts. So almost guaranteed you are going to make sales, you're going to make profit. Now, if you would like to apply to Amazon Merch, I have a video about it here that's going to walk you through everything you need to know. But by far, this is one of my favorite passive income businesses that you could start. Now, the other sites that you definitely could make accounts on that don't have this application process are going to be Redbubble, Zazzle, TeePublic, but you also could sell print on demand through Etsy as well. So a lot of times we think of Etsy as being a place where everything is handmade, where you're doing stuff in your own house, and then you're going to be responsible for distributing it. But if you partner with a place like Printify, who becomes kind of the manufacturing partner for you, again, you're going to only have to make the listings and then they're taking care of most everything else. However, with Etsy, there is a little bit of customer service that you're going to have to do. So it is a little bit less passive than some of those other sites I mentioned. You are going to have to kind of maintain that while some of these other ones you can just upload and let it go but i still think it's a really really great way to make extra money every single month definitely one of my top choices for a passive income business that's actually going to make you real profit now the next passive income idea that i love and have done for a long time is actually to create low content books on kindle direct publishing if you're not familiar with kindle direct publishing there are several different things you can do once you create an account on there. One is you can create ebooks that can be purchased and put on Kindles or e-readers, but they also have a really cool thing where you can upload books that are then going to be printed on demand just like those t-shirts would be. So you're creating everything that is going to go inside this book from the cover to the inside pages, but then again, you don't have to have an inventory. You aren't putting any money up front. Amazon is simply printing this item every time it is purchased and you are getting a percentage of what it is sold for. Every single book that is purchased, you can make several dollars on it. And while you can use this, if you are a real author that is writing a full book that you're going to sell, that's also a great way to make income, but it's a little bit less passive. But what you can do is you can actually create low content books. So these are things like 
creating themed notebooks. So you simply are creating the cover that is around a certain theme or a niche. It could be something like teachers, nurses. You could do something for Montessori moms. You could do something for doula. So there are so many different ideas, but then in the inside, you simply are going to put lined pages. So you're not doing the work of creating a full book that is going to be sold. But those kind of really specific niche down themed notebooks sell very, very well for me. And I actually kind of pair this with my own print on demand t-shirt business. So if I have t-shirts that sell well in certain niches, I almost certainly always put those same designs on a book cover with just lined pages inside and those sell really, really well. But you also can take the low content book publishing just a step further, which I would say is more like medium content books. So instead of just doing simple lined pages, you're going to create something like a log or a tracker. And these are still very, very low effort up front. And once you post it, it is completely passive. But this could be something like a weight loss journal, or you could do maybe a certain method of cleaning journal or like a homeschool notebook for a mom or a certain kind of planner. The the possibilities are really endless, but again, you would just be responsible for the researching and creating these books. Once you upload them, you don't have to put any money up front. You're not shipping. You're not packing the orders. You don't do any customer service. So it is truly very, very passive as long as you're uploading new designs somewhat frequently. This is a completely free business to start and it doesn't have an application process like Amazon Merch does. So if you have tried and tried to be part of that program, this is definitely one of the next best things that you can do. You could literally get started with this in the morning and have a bunch of books uploaded by the end of the day. So this is a great business to start and you can definitely make thousands every single month doing this. Now, the next passive income idea that you could literally make anywhere from hundreds of dollars on this every single month to literal tens of thousands doing this is to create your own digital ebook or some kind of course that people are going to download and use. Now, a lot of times with something like a course or a digital ebook, people feel like they already need to have a huge following. They need to be a real expert in a space to be able to sell something like that. And that is so untrue. I personally know people who have followings of either just a couple thousand or even less who have launched a course or an ebook and made so much profit on this. With a course or an ebook, you definitely are going to be spending time upfront creating all of this material, but then once it is finished, you can continue to sell it time and time again without doing any additional work on that. Now, if you think that you don't have anything that you could sell an ebook or a course on, that is certainly not true. Even with a small or no initial following, you can definitely find something that you already know how to do and you're somewhat of an expert in that you could sell to those people who are interested in this niche topic. So with many of these passive income businesses, niching down is really where the money is. So you aren't gonna just make a course on maybe generic parenting, but if you can really hone that down and find what you are an expert in, that is where all of the money is. Maybe you had a great time and found a method of how to get your kid to stop taking their pacifier every day. You could create an ebook or a course on exactly how to do that. And that is filling a very specific need that people have and they're willing to pay money for that. Other courses or ebooks that you could do that would sell well is maybe you are really good at making sourdough bread. And that has been all the rage lately. So if you just create a sourdough bread 101 course that is going to teach you everything from how to find your starter to how to bake your first loaves, and then maybe how to get a little bit more fancy with those, you could sell something like that for maybe $99. And people who really want to learn that are going to pay that money. Same thing with if you are a very good artist or painter in a specific craft, you can monetize and sell that. Or maybe you are a homeschool mom or you have done preschool for your kids in your own home. There are so many people that want to do that, but they don't even know where to start. So they are willing to pay for you to take them from A to Z, how to get started step by step. And it's really tempting to think that, well, all of this information is already out there. They can look and watch videos on YouTube, but so often people are willing to pay for the convenience of someone literally walking them through step-by-step 
holding their hand in this. So if you have any expertise, you can definitely monetize that through an ebook or course. Now, the next passive income business that you could become a literal millionaire from doing is actually creating an affiliate marketing business. So a lot of times when we think of affiliate marketing, we're thinking of that huge influencer that's linking their Stanley Cup, they're linking their makeup, their new tech gadgets, and that is not what I mean. You can create an affiliate marketing business with zero following whatsoever. So how this works is, have you ever looked up something like best Father's Day gifts or best laptop to purchase, and you've had so many results come up that are just literally web pages with kind of a synopsis of maybe the 10 best laptops to buy right now. In doing affiliate marketing, you are going to be doing something like that. There are many different affiliate marketing websites to sign up from, but the, definitely the biggest one, the one that most people are a part of is Amazon Associates because you can be an affiliate for any product on Amazon and it's free to get started on there on Amazon Associates and pretty much anyone gets accepted to that program. Now, what you would be doing is you're going to create very niche specific web pages that are going to be writing affiliate marketing articles like those ones we just talked about. So like all of these other passive income ideas, the more specific you can get is where you are going to have the most chance to actually stand out and make sales. If you are going to create an affiliate marketing website, I wouldn't do something that's just generic tech or reviewing the latest laptops. You want to really hone down and do a very specific thing. And it really doesn't have to be something that you are super interested in yourself. Just after doing some research, if you identify kind of a niche that there is not a lot of competition in, you can make so much money. So this could, could be something like you wouldn't wanna do just generic tech, but maybe you wanted to create a website that wrote affiliate articles for all kinds of smart home pet devices. Now, there are probably so many out there and you could just start writing articles like top 10 smart home pet devices to get in 2023. You could do top five pet lover gifts for the smart tech lover, maybe top 10 smart home pet gadgets under $100 or best Christmas gifts for your pet. The possibilities are really endless, but in each of those, you are literally just going to link the product and you're going to write a little blurb about it and put the picture of the item there. And then these types of sites are going to start ranking on Google with their SEO. Sometimes it can take a little bit to get started on these, but eventually they're going to start ranking organically, especially if you've really capitalized on a very niche sector of the market and you can kind of pump out a bunch of these kind of articles that are going to be linking products. So then the next time that someone looks up best techie pet gift for Christmas, hopefully one of your articles is going to come up answering that specific question and then you're gonna get profit on every single sale that when someone clicks on the item to purchase it. And the profit that you get can be anywhere from like 2% all the way up to 25% on affiliate sales. It just really depends on the item. But this is a great way to, with no existing audience, to capitalize on people searching for these very specific things. Now, the next passive income business that you could start is one that I personally love because I certainly do it. And right off the bat, you might not think that this is a super passive business model, but in reality, you're creating something that is going to make money month after month, day after day, long after you stop working on that. And that is to create a YouTube channel. But if you really want to make passive income, you are going to want to create a channel that is kind of helping with a specific problem, answering certain questions. Now with YouTube, you are going to be paid in many different ways, but the most passive way is going to be being paid by Google AdSense. Every time someone watches your video, they're being shown ads and you are making a small amount of money on every single time someone watches through one of those. Now, creating the initial videos is not going to be passive, but if you're creating videos that are answering commonly asked questions in your niche, they are going to continue to get views month after month long after you posted them. I have many videos from almost a year ago that maybe didn't really explode in the algorithm right away when I first posted them, but because they were ask, answering a very specific question 
or going through a very specific tutorial, people continue to watch them. Day after day, they generate hundreds of new views every single day, which leads to me making money on those long after they initially have been posted. Now, if you create an entire library of those types of videos that people are going back to and watching long after they've been posting, this is a very passive business model. So even if I stopped creating YouTube videos all together this month, I still have a whole library of videos that are walking people through very specific things, answering very specific questions that will continue to get views and I will continue to make money after them long after I stopped posting. So if there is any area of expertise you have, just like with a course or an ebook, a YouTube channel is a great place to start because you can simply share your expertise, answer very specific questions, and then using YouTube or Google as a search engine, people are going to come across your videos and then you are going to make money based on every single view that you get. Now, along with YouTube, there are many other ways to monetize having a channel that can be both passive and not so passive. So it definitely is a great endeavor to get into if you are looking to start kind of a side business. The next really lucrative passive income idea that you could start super easily is actually creating some kind of digital product or digital download to sell on a place like Etsy. Now there are so many different ones of these that you could choose from. So I've actually created an entire video here which outlines 10 more of what I think are the best digital products that you could sell online make sure you take a look at that next. And let me know down in the comments which one of these passive income ideas you would love a more in-depth tutorial or video on, and I'll try to make that happen for you guys. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.